Hi everybody, today we're going to talk about vertical versus lateral reading. It's just going to be really quick. So vertical reading is when you evaluate a site just on that site alone. And we have different tools to do that, like the CRAP test, which is lovely named, and it stands for currency, relevance, authority, accuracy, and purpose. There is also another one that I like to use, which is called the radar evaluation. And this stands, this is another acronym that stands for rationale, authority, date, accuracy, and relevance. And you can see they're both very similar in what they're having you look for. But the whole point is that if you're looking on the website that you're trying to verify for information to verify it, chances are that they could be pretty smart and they could just lie. They could make up all of that information about who they are, what their expertise is. So you want to read laterally. You want to go to another website in order to figure out what's going on there. So I have an example. And this is a lovely website. It looks pretty professionally done, right? Scroll down, there are pictures. There's even primary source documents, activism. Okay, how you can help, FAQs. We even have a link to the author. So we could click on that. Okay, we could read about the author. Okay, so again, if we're only checking vertically within the website, then we may not be able to get down to the bottom of this site. Although we might, it's possible. But if we read laterally, if we click away from this site and we type in, uh, tree octopus here website real and as you can see if we scroll down just in our choices NBC we know NBC is a good source an octopus in a tree seems real doesn't it so let's go ahead and click there and see what NBC has to say Okay, it's on the internet, so it must be true. If you answered yes to that question, perhaps you were in the market for a nice bridge. That's a joke. So again, if you scroll down, you're going to see that this is not a legitimate website. We can go back. We can look at the next one. LiveScience.com. Kids believe literally anything they read on the internet. Okay. But what's funny is that we don't even know that Live Science is a legit site. So we would also have to go ahead and verify this site. But the great news is that once you verify a site, it's yours forever. So you, once you know that a site is good and reliable, then you can use it over and over again. And you don't have to keep re-verifying it. Okay, so that's a little snippet of vertical versus lateral reading. Hopefully that helped clarify. Vertical reading does still have its merits, but you want to make sure that you're clicking away from that site to really go ahead and verify all of that, um, the radar criteria and the crap criteria. You want to make sure that you're clicking away from the site in order to verify that. Okay, thank you so much.